Hey everybody, how's it going? Thought I'd do a pour this morning. Ooh, I'm tired, but I feel like doing one anyway. Um, what I'm going to do, this is a 16 by 20, so it takes almost 12 ounces of paint to cover it, and we'll have a base coat. But I'm going to layer the colors in a 9 ounce cup. But then I'm going to pour it into open cups, split it up into three. So we'll see what happens. I'm going to flood the canvas with white, and I'll be right back. Okay, got it covered in white. If you can't hear the TV in the other room, it's on for noise for the dog, basically. But if it sounds like the wolf pack is... Consuming a carcass, it's because he's got a giant bone in there on the floor and I've got hardwood, so it sort of resonates. <laughs> okay, I'll start with a little bit of white. This is in our nine ounce cup. I have got that's Deco Art Deep Sapphire. Deco Art 24 karat gold, of course. Do a little dot of white. This yellow is Liquitex Basics yellow with a whole lot. Actually, it's a lot of my straight white added to it. I think I put a little smidge of 24 karat gold in there. But anyway, it's pretty yellow. And I do a little dot of white. And copper, this was like a half ounce of antique copper left. And I got uh, the only copper I could find was worn penny. So it's also deco art. Do a little bit in case it's a bully. Copper does that sometimes. Ooh, that's a gorgeous color though. A little dot of white. And this is Deco Art Turquoise. Dot of white. I'm not going to be afraid of white anymore. Overage. Uh, Deco Art Fire Opal, just a little, and I've got another cup of the yellow over here, so I'm going to put the rest of this cup on top of there, Damn it. that cup. Now we're going to start over a little smidge of white. Deep sapphire. Twenty-four karat gold. Smidge of white. That is so pretty. I hope it's not a bully. We'll find out. A smidge of white. Turquoise. White. Fire opal. Yellow. We are going 
going to have a full, 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 full cup. Stop. Yeah. Okay. Hee-haw. Alrighty then. Flooded with white, got rid of the bubbles, got our cup poured. And we're going to see about this. Actually. Don't worry if it looks lumpy now, it won't later. That was easy. Going on the outside. between them there's enough white in between them. Okay. Hee hee. Oh my god, can I pick the cup up? Hee hee. Not another drop. Oh my word. Dare I try to pinch it? Goodness gracious. I think I'm just going to pour in a circle and see what happens. Yep, I'm going there. All right, just put some interest in that big white blob in the middle. Oh, this is cool, people. I think, so far. <laughs> we'll see what happens, of course. They take on a life of their own. Oh, this is awesomeness. I gotta stop and get a couple of close-ups and bring in just a minute you're gonna love this okay this is the scary part lord don't let me screw it up was that cool or what now let's see i think tilt it a bit and let them move Picking up the lip and dropping it. I was getting the cups were scraping the canvas as they went down, so let's just walk them off here. Let's see what happens. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh oh. Oh, out of juice. No, nope, there it And there's some big bubbles in there that are not popping for some reason. Yeah. Clunking. That is also cool because it vibrates the canvas and that makes waves in the paint. I love physics. Okay. That's what we got. Let's see what we end up with. I'm looking at an alien face right now, so. 
I love finding out what other people see. I don't want to go off just yet. Middle, slow down a little bit. It's okay if we leave white. That didn't even hurt a thing. Back to the middle. That side. That needs some more. I like a good wave of white out in front of the composition that keeps it from rolling over and keeps the edge that's on there. I'd kind of like to keep it white on the opposite side. So let's get back to the middle. And start over again. Stretch down this way. Take your time. You can walk it down rather than throw it down. And keep them in the white corner. middle. You can see us losing some of that green off that corner. Sorry, I don't know where you're at. That's good. Back. On this side of it, don't move. I'm kind of stretching out the middle and that side over there. Just watch where your pattern is moving and adjust accordingly. I'm actually going to stop. That's kind of awesome. some wispy, we've got some defined, and I've got on a shirt I shouldn't paint in because it's like gigantic. Oh, pity. Okay, need the torch to fire up and eat. Gath in it. Well, that's got some nifty bits. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. And Okay. You get my fingers wiped off and I will bring you down for the close-up. I am ready for a close-up, Mr. DeMille. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it sounds, there's a gigantic dog getting a drink of water. I'm sure you can hear that. He needs a lot of water after having a bone dish. Oh, boy. Sorry about the glare. It is what it is. There's some cute bits. Those are awesome. There's squiggly bits in that. See, I'm glad I did that so it's not a big blob of white in the middle. And... Ooh, that looks like a butterfly. Very cool, but oh. Hello. <laughs> Why 
do you see? Let me know in the comments. Hope you enjoyed. Check the uh, full drop down for more information. Everybody take care.